Well, hello again, fine people. Here I am again with a Sims 2 video. Uh, Greg Wheeler is no longer a family friend, I don't care. Um, as you may remember from the last Sims 2 video I did, that I gave birth to twin baby aliens. Um, so, here I am, single dad with two baby aliens. Um, this one's uh, Xanadu, I've been uh, sort of, uh, sort of, sorting out, I guess you could say, uh, Xander, the other alien baby, who happens to be over here in this in this crib here because I figured well I'm gonna need to keep one downstairs uh, he appears to be awake at the moment he was asleep uh, when I put him in uh, but now it looks like he's awake um, the only problem is is like, where can I put uh, Z Xanadu? Now, I bought the baby chair, but apparently they're too young to use it yet. Um, and uh, I think, as I mentioned before, um, I'm not sure if the kids will age. I mean, I, I can't click on uh, their sort of squares yet because they're too young to control and that's kind of the problem uh, oh I'm actually friends with Xanadu now that was easy enough Xander isn't quite my friend yet even though I have been playing and cuddling with him obviously to uh, to sort of you know build up a friendship with him I don't want them you know growing up uh, sort of not liking me um, what I'll we'll try and do is da, da, da. Ah, there we go. Bathe Xanadu because uh, I gave Xander a bath a little earlier. Now, obviously, because they're babies, uh, you can't put them in the big bath. Uh, and I didn't realise. I mean, he kind of did it on his own. He uh, he gave. Xander a bath so and this is how he does it <laughs> basically this is uh, the way this is the way you bathe an alien <laughs> um, but uh, so yeah this it's kind of uh, it's kind of spot things <laughs> a little bit um because I mean obviously it's mucked up my gameplay somewhat somewhat I say and uh, <laughs> and so I'm really not too sure what I can do uh, I'm gonna cuddle and play a little bit more um, I think what I will need to do is, oh, let me see, can I hold, ah, I think what I need, well, it says let Xander out, not exactly sure how that happens, does that just mean it can like, I don't know, put down the side of the crib and like, the baby will like just get out or, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what's going on. Um, okay, so let's see what happens. Uh, oh, it, it, it looks like he's gone to sleep. Ah, oh, see, and... <laughs> oh, well, the, sorry, Xander, but... Jeez. Uh, <laughs> I feel a bit bad now because uh, what? No, you, you can't go to sleep. What the? 
Uh, right, hold. Uh -huh. it, it, it makes it a bit worse. Oh, I'm not saying worse, but... Well, yeah, it, does, it makes it worse because... Uh, having the two babies and there's just, like, one of me. You know what I mean? You've got to kind of... I mean, I, I don't know who is being fed because I can't see... Um, I can't see their needs. Um, right, so... Let's wait for that to disappear. Right. Come and hold... If I just get him to come and hold Xanadu and then... Come and put in the crib. Uh, oh, well, is that one green or... I don't know, it's because I chose... Okay. Oh. Um, and this is the, the problem as well, is that... Obviously, I need to... See to my needs. And it's... Kind of... Uh, Farmers. Uh, no, I was going to answer that phone anyway. Um, oh, and, and I, I just knew that it would be sunny. Do to go on the downtown. Um, with these kind of stats now. Now, sorry, <laughs> uh, because he needs to use the toilet. Oh, before I forget, uh, just before, well, I'll say just before, before I started recording, uh, I had the two nannies here. Uh, I think, I think you may have seen those at the end of the last video. I'm not sure if I did or not, but anyway. Uh, I had those the, the two nannies here because for some reason there are two babies you need two nannies so anyway um, when I started the game um, I think I I don't know if I left I can't remember the end of the the video but I, I must have been uh, in the hot tub with with somebody and that's where I started this new game um, so I was in the hot tub, and then it, apparently, this guy, uh, uh, these people that like they have the blue plum bob above their head. Apparently, those people are the ones that you've inv you've invited back to your house to sleep, as in not to stay in the night. I'm like, um, because that, uh, the one of them, Connor, has come up, uh, so sort of said to me, "Well, you invited me over to." to spend the night or something but you didn't let me sleep and I'm thinking really I didn't even invite you back to my house so why would you want to sleep here uh, and then a, another sim uh, sort of did and said the same and I'm like yeah I'm not sure that uh, I really did invite you back to my place to sleep so, so there's that. After they went, um, the, the, the two nannies were sort of in uh, the, the kids' room and they just kept like walking around. And I was thinking, why, why are they just walking around? Uh, they would pick one of the babies up, um, take them to the corner, and give that thing that that signal where they can't access somewhere, they can't walk to anywhere, you know. And uh, oh dear, boohoo! Uh, and I thought, 
why are they doing that what's the problem I mean they managed to get go into the bathroom um, and I, I checked with my sim he seemed to be able to go like anywhere um, up, upstairs here in fact he even came upstairs from downstairs because he was in the hot tub he came upstairs now this is where it got strange the reason <coughs> excuse me the reason they couldn't uh, do anything they kept picking the baby up sticking him in the corner and uh, just leaving it there and I'm like what is going on for some reason the stairs had suddenly failed <laughs> and, uh, I'm like how do stairs fail they're like stairs you walk up them you walk down them how do they fail how can you not access the stairs they are right there but apparently for some reason they couldn't use the stairs so I pretty much just took the old stairs out and put new ones in which are basically the same but now the stairs are working so that means I can go up and down stairs again don't ask me why I do not know so anyway uh, as you see things are back to normal things are working so that was a bit of a strange thing <laughs> I, I, I really I have no idea why they couldn't walk down the stairs you know why the stairs I forgot out of stairs you know what I mean <laughs> so uh, oh Tanira goes he's gonna I think he's gonna feed uh, whichever baby he's got I'm not sure which one so I will get him to feed this baby which one is it Xanadu Xanadu Right, that's it. Just uh, stick to what? It's hailing. Oh, right. Uh, put in crib. Oh, no, 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 no. Don't put in crib yet. Uh, change diaper. And then put her in there. Then once she's sorted, uh, I will need to I will need to yeah stop jerking please can you like run smoother per chance uh, and clean up if you don't mind of course oh jab because it certainly needs cleaning up in there in fact I think the uh, the trash compactor is getting rather um, rather full. Um, yeah, th this would have been nice if you could have done them like you know, all at the same time. Ah, oh, see, I mean, it needs to be at work in an hour. you can't leave the kids on their own um, <laughs> adoption service F 
funnily enough, I was thinking about that, yeah. <laughs> because, uh, because, well, I'll be happy to take you, da, 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 da. Uh, if you'd like, I can keep track of your schedule in my calendar so that I'll always be there for your kids when you can't be. Okay. That's probably a good idea. Because obviously my guy need, still needs to... Uh... Right. Okay, and by the looks of it, you'll be out of the house from 8am to 4pm. But now you have nothing to worry about because I'll be there. Right. But are you coming today? Uh, because <laughs> I kind of uh, yes no money no it doesn't help because they're coming today okay well it looks like uh, I need to look after the kids uh, myself today uh, right let's change uh, Zander's diaper luckily I have some vacation days so I'm guessing it, it won't matter if I have today off. Oh, great, is the nanny. Better late than never, eh? Right, well, let's... Uh, let, let, let's see if he can drive to work. Because, like I said, I'm, I'm guessing just because there are like two babies, one nanny should be sufficient. Really, I mean, they should be able to manage two. So, uh, yeah, and at least the nannies will will know what they need. So, maybe a little late for work, but there you go. Oh, late for work, everyone makes mistakes. Da, 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 da. But don't make a habit out of this or Andrew will be in trouble. Who's coming to visit? Who's that? Mary Gavigan. Oh, right, yeah, one of the new ones. Uh, you appear to be visiting in your nightwear. Well, it looks like nightwear to me. Wow. And is it me or does, uh, does a face look rather thin? Are you eating, madam? <laughs> anyway, carry on. Um, so, yeah. Uh, what? Um... No, I'm not home. Go away. You're not going to go in my hot tub while I'm not here. So, yeah. So, here we go. Um, like I say, me and the babies. The alien babies at that. Um, this is kind of, I guess, how it's got to be for a while. Um, as I mentioned before, I think I may have to take the uh, the aging off off if you know what I mean and turn the aging back on uh, so that the kids can grow up but the thing was I didn't want to grow up I didn't want to age as well now this was a good thing with uh, the Sims actually um, 
you can stop yourself from aging but you can let the rest of the sims age oh hello uh bought i a friend works from 10 till 4 immediately bought on lots of money you're a corporate raider and mogul blah 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 and i've basically reached the top of the career then Oh, alrighty then. So, that's it. Top of the business career. Um, so now I've done that, uh, I think I'm going to have to uh, have a go at doing his uh, that, that, that reputation. I'm a social boss celebrity! Interests, uh, hobby enthusiasm, memories, chemistry. Oh, right, yeah. Uh, memories. Cuisine. Interests. Uh, Sim bio, I've put nothing in there. Oh, look, oh, I'm thinking of. No, 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 that's right. Hang on, if I click on there, are there any. How do you, what are talent badges? I think I'll have to. I'll have to look that up, I think. Uh, <laughs> so there we go, I'm a business tycoon, I'm top of the business ladder, and you want me to get. Paid two thousand one hundred. No, no, that's per day, but it's not. It, it's not the best you can do. And I think um, relationships. No, that's uh, no. Uh, that's that. Who's this guy anyway? Gordon Wallace and Go. When you bring this guy, I'm mean, not even your friend. <laughs> Brings these people home, so why? He's not even a friend. Um, oh, right, it's these things. There it is. Aspiration meter. The aspiration meter shows how well your sim is doing. Uh, is a savant supra. That was mainly because I, uh, I did the magic lamp thing. I think I actually, I actually sold that, I think, the magic lamp, so... Yeah. <laughs> I'm like, constant platinum, baby. Uh, lifetime one, that was right. Become a criminal mastermind, that's it. So, uh, I think that is basically what I'll have to do next, really. I mean... Uh, lifetime aspiration meter. You've mastered the art of living a success. Yada, 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 yada. What was that sim on there? Ah, oh, that's the influence meter. Master manipulator. Yeah, that's the maximum. So, right. Well, I think I'll leave it there for now. You've kind of all caught up with me. Uh, well, you've caught up with me, I've caught up with the game a bit because it, it's been a little while since I've played it and he's left a baby on the kitchen floor. So, <laughs> so I want to go and deal with that. Um, also, thank you for watching. Uh, please like and subscribe if you'd like to see more. Um, because I'll, I'll, st I'll still be doing more Sims 2 uh, uh, yeah, videos, playthroughs, whatever. Uh, I'll, yeah, I'll be carrying on because this one will be part 10 of my current... Uh, play through. What I will be doing is having a look at whether or not I need to set the aging on for the children to grow up. Um, or, oh, well, actually, when I was thinking about contacting the adoption agency, I'm, I'm not sure if that's to. Um, put your own kids up for adoption or to adopt kids I'm not sure so I'm gonna have to look into that uh, 
I think I, I probably would like to uh, sort of keep the kids, if you know what I mean. And like, there's a where's the thing? I think there's a look in the options. Uh, no, nothing there. I know that there's something. Uh, story mode. Yeah, 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 yeah. Now, once again, I'm probably thinking of. Um, I'm probably thinking of thingamajig Sims 4 where you can like send it just send the kids off to college if you know what I mean unless ah now I think you can do that from the main menu something else I'm gonna have to look into but obviously the, the kids are like way too young to go off to college anyway um, so I'm not sure what I can do there. Uh, it's a bit of a, <laughs> a bit of a dilemma, isn't it, really? So uh, right, once again, like I say, join me next time. Thanks for watching, and uh, see you next time. Bye.